So here we are in the middle of the woods. So here we are in the middle of the woods and this is home to the hairy bitch and uh, the hairy bitch is a very famous witch of the area. She would used to go and kidnap children from the local schools and yeah there's it's rumored that she is buried underneath this very tree. This tree here uh, I believe it was in like the early 1900s so around like 1902. Uh, her name was Gwendolyn Watafanyich and uh, yeah, she was famous for stealing kids and killing them and eating them and uh, making potions, etc. It's quite a well-known story in the area, so... But I decided to come out here because obviously uh, we have a new release out this week and I wanted to go and show a bit of the history of my area, so... Yeah, hopefully we won't get spotted or anything by her. She's uh, known to uh, go around the woods and uh, still look for children, so... It's, it's quite terrifying, really, because these sort of things still do happen. But anyway... Here we are, and this is a tree, and I'm not gonna to touch it, because apparently, if you touch it, you get bad luck from, uh, and you're gonna get visited by the witch. So, I don't think that's gonna, oh. Fuck. Shit. I fucking touched it. It's a superstition. There's no such thing. Let's get out of here. You know, it's weird. I can hear children, but there's no schools for miles. That's terrifying. <laughs> oh. God, how do you get out of here? This is the way I came, but it looks completely different. Fuck. Oh, what was that? There's something over there. Oh my God, I'm going to have to get up under these. I'm only videoing for, what the fuck is that? Oh my God, what the fuck is that? What, what the fuck is that? What the fuck am I? Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. This is where she used to live. Oh my God. Gotta be careful. Ooh. This is where she used to live. <laughs> this is her front door. Used to be door right here, wooden door. Pock her up, bitch! <laughs> Fuck that shit. Let's go Blu ray hunting. Then into hmm, which is short for HMV. And we're gonna have a look in here, see what we can find today. Nearly shit my pants back in the woods, but uh, I've cleaned myself up, I've dusted myself off, and here we go. What's we got in the new section? And we've got first thing I'm seeing is the Blair Witch Project, which is an absolute horror classic for me. Love this film. $21.99 for a two-disc set. And we've got what's this called? Prodigy, Star Trek Prodigy Season 2. Never seen it. 
It ends with us, which is a very good film. I really enjoyed this one. The wife recommended it and it was good. Blake, seven, never seen it, but yeah, very nice box set, 40 pounds. And over here we got Bleach. I don't know which season it is, 45 pounds. Nice slip cover. We got on 4K still book, Train Spotting. Very good film, saw this years ago. I've always enjoyed it. We've got Austin Powers, yeah, baby. Yeah, groovy, baby. Yeah, very nice. And here on the Criterion label, we've got Godzilla. Isn't it amazing? Everybody else starts going Godzilla. The second that I start going Godzilla. But there we go. This is Godzilla on Criterion label, 22 99 for the Blu-ray, 30 for the 4K. And here we have the big box edition of the Blair Witch Project. This is a fantastic set, 44 99 two cuts to the film. And yeah, amazing. What else we got? Oh, we've got Kill Bill Volume 1 and 2 re-release. I do like this artwork, believe it or not. It's nice on the back as well, $8.99 each. Let's have a look at this one. I'll tell you one thing now that was most impressive about this was the spine. You wait till you see the spines, how they line up. Look at that. That is freaking awesome. Fan bloody tastic. Right, where else we got? We've got this one here, Super Space Theatre. This is an amazing set for £30. That is a bargain if you ask me. Five Blu-rays. Yeah, very good indeed. Yes, nice indeed. And we got this as well. I saw this at £34.99. One piece. Yes, never seen it. Did he or didn't he? I don't know, but it's £14.99 and it actually sounds quite good. And down at the Funko Pop section, we've got some new killer clown ones. This is, well, this talk to Frank. <laughs> this is pretty damn cool. £14.99. I do like this Funko Pop. As you know me, I love me some killer clowns from outer space. And there's me, Chubby. <laughs> He's got the same haircut as well. Fan bloody tastic. And here we have uh, Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. And yes, very nice indeed. I can see a couple of reasons why people like this. Moving on. And we've also got a e a e what, 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 what? Edward Scissorhands. I love this film. Love old Tim Burton movies. This is a good one. And we've got Exena, Warrior Princess. Used to watch this years ago. Wasn't mad on it, but I remember it being a pretty good show. And here's Willow. Got this for $2.99 at a home bargain. So yeah, very good come down. Anyway, thanks for watching this video, guys. Hope you can do well. Do any pickups today, and I'll go straight out after this. So, thanks for watching. Do appreciate more videos coming soon. Please like, share, and subscribe. Stay safe, play safe, and bye for now. Are you coming back, big boy? You can fuck right off. Oh, bloody cheek. Fuck her up, bitch. <laughs> Somebody over there. <laughs> I'm hiding by the fucking tree. They saw me in my pink wig. Oh my god. Oh well. <laughs>